Welcome to update 3.9 of the Stream Deck MIDI plugin. This is part 1 for the 3.9 update and this video is all about dials. So let's start with the generic MIDI dial, which now can send pitch bend, channel pressure and program change messages. And these messages can be sent from all actions, dial rotate, rotate while pressed, press action and the screen tap actions. Another change for the generic MIDI dial and the Mackie control dial is that the left screen tap action is now a separate action detached from the dial press action. So you have a new section for the left screen tap action. If you had icons defined for the press action before, these will be migrated to the left screen tap action instead, and the action will be configured to use the same commands as the dial press action. So it will continue to work as it did before. But if you want to set something separate for the left screen tap action, you can do that. And you can now also set the right screen tap action to use the dial press configuration if you want to. The show large icon checkbox is available for both left and right screen action, but it's the same setting, so it doesn't matter which one you select, it will affect both actions. The final change for dials, for all dials, even the multi dials, is that the list of actions is pretty long, and you now have an option to keep a single section open. So if you select a new section, it will close the other section, so it's easier to navigate the editor. That's all for this video. Check out part two if you haven't done so. Mm -hmm. 